Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to use the KitchenAid ice cream maker attachment. I'm going to be using my four and a half quart KitchenAid Ultra Power Mixer. The attachment is really easy to use and you'll have homemade ice cream in about half an hour. So the ice cream maker comes with this drive assembly that fits onto the head, just like that. It also comes with the bowl. The bowl has to be in the freezer for a minimum of 15 hours before you can make the ice cream. The bowl fits onto the base. You just turn it counterclockwise. This is the dasher that goes right into the ice cream bowl. And this is the adapter ring that goes on the bottom of the bowl to fit different models of KitchenAid mixers. We're gonna be making vanilla bean ice cream. There are just a few simple ingredients. Cream, milk, sugar, and vanilla beans. If you can't find vanilla beans, you could use vanilla extract instead. These are the dried vanilla pods. We'll split them open and take out the vanilla beans. So you take the pod and with a small sharp knife, make a slit. And inside are the beans. We'll just scrape it out. After you've scraped all the seeds out of the pod, you can save the pods by putting them in a container of sugar and that'll make vanilla sugar. I want a really intense vanilla flavor in my ice cream, so I'm going to use vanilla beans and the vanilla extract. So I have the sugar, the vanilla beans, and the vanilla extract in my bowl. I'll add the cream. and milk. I'm going to thoroughly mix the ingredients. The sugar is dissolved and we're ready to make the ice cream. Attach the drive assembly. Fit your bowl in. And put the dasher in the bowl. Lock the head and you're ready to use the machine. Remember to only take the bowl out of the freezer when you're ready to make the ice cream. Turn the machine on first to the lowest speed. Now we'll slowly pour in our ingredients. eight minutes, you can see ice cream starting to form in the middle of the bowl. After 20 minutes, we have really soft ice cream. You could put this in the freezer for about 20 minutes or half hour and it'll harden up. The prep time to make the ice cream is very long. The bowl itself has to be chilled for a minimum of 15 hours. The ice cream mixture has to be chilled for a couple of hours. Once you turn the machine on, the ice cream is made relatively quickly. However, because of the long prep time and then having to put this mixture in the freezer for another half an hour until it hardens, the whole process is just long and somewhat inefficient. However, 
The taste of the ice cream makes the process totally worth it. This is hands down the best vanilla ice cream that I've ever had. The ice cream is creamy with just the right amount of sweetness and the vanilla flavor is amazing. You know this is real vanilla ice cream because you can see the vanilla beans all throughout the ice cream. The link to this ice cream maker and some alternatives are in the description below. Hope you enjoyed this review. Please subscribe and thanks for watching.